to another story now. This is The Guardian. Lewis has got this one, a story about women knowing their limits. More than half of British girls lack confidence learning math, Paul finds. And this is from Teach First, some uh, education thing. It says that a f quite a few men are not confident with math or science, but more, more women is. And that, that can't be. It's funny. The thing about... The, the thing about this can't be right. I mean, look at Carol Vorderman. Yeah, look at her. Like, she's great at maths. She's, I mean, the, I mean, she's the exception that proves the rule. Well, I am terrible at yeah. maths, and I'm not a woman. Prove the rule. You know the word prove. It doesn't mean, like, prove it. It means, like, test the rule. Yes. That's right. That yeah. is what it means. That's what it, it means. So, so the issue here is that, well, they, what, they're trying to uh, change something or, or make it so that more girls are doing maths? Or what, what's the, what's because the, this is in The Guardian. The recommendation is more money is spent money. On, yeah. on teachers. The fact is... Well, that's that's fair enough, isn't The it? fact is, girls don't have any confidence when they don't have any lack of confidence when they open up an OnlyFans account. <laughs> <laughs> Lewis, they... <laughs> you are aware that that is not typical female behavior, right? Do you know what it is? It's like the number one career choice for women nowadays. Yeah. Have you heard this? I'm, I'm, what I I'm can't saying believe is, you're saying this. Do you know what the truth is? If you, if the truth is... Women don't like STEM subjects because you know what? Men don't like STEM sub subjects either. Nobody likes STEM, but men have to go into STEM because we're not attractive and we have no value outside how much money I, we make. I can't decide if this is really misogynistic or anti-male. <laughs> you're, like, you're, you're all over the place. Leo, yeah. do you have any thoughts about this? Well, this, they say like, girls lack confidence in maths yes. and, and stuff like that. And what they're measuring is the confidence. Yeah. It doesn't mean girls are worse at maths. No. It just means they don't have this false bravado that young men do. Excellent point. Yeah, that, that's right. Yeah. That's right. And that men are delusional. Maybe that's well, how they boast more. Yeah. 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 So, the, I mean, the, the men are going to be gung-ho. I'm great at maths going out there yeah. getting all the sums wrong. The women are probably being like, oh, I'm so terrible at this Wait, and then getting all the yeah. sums right. I did notice this when I was a teacher, and we were talked about this in the teacher training, that if you were teaching a co-ed group, often the boys would be the first to put their hands up. Yeah. They'll be all swagger and like, I know the answer to everything. Yeah. Often the best and brightest students would be the girls who just wouldn't yeah. do that. And of course, the girls would outperform the boys in the exams. Yeah. So, I mean, it just goes to show, doesn't it? Well, you've got a daughter. You should raise her to be a bit more, a bit more like Lewis, you know, a bit more front-footed. <laughs> That's what I think you should do. Always good advice. We're